Hello friends, Maki Master here. Thank you so much for watching Arts Therapy for Me, and welcome to my session. Please give me a thumbs up and a subscribe so I can send you a lifetime of good vibes. All right, uh, slapping my uh, rice on the nori right now. Um, we're doing the narration of Snoop Dogg, the, my version of the original California roll, the real California roll. So I start, uh, start off with a squidding sketch here. Uh, you know, you gotta work it over the rice. It's, it's at first difficult, but now I'm so used to it. Kind of the new normal for me is drawing over rice. <laughs> so I just get all the lines in there. I try to get them as, as, as good as possible. You know, like a, the best underdrawing for a painting. So it, it's, um, it's a map to start putting my fish on there. So I'm using tuna, yellowfin tuna, which is very moldable. It's one of my favorite fish. Uh, it's used in all sushi bars for nigiri, sashimi rolls. So we're using it because it makes a good complexion here with the eel sauce and it's very moldable. So I'm doing his face, his cheeks, his forehead. I start from the top down uh, just, it's, just goes better that way. It's all a process. I had a lot of fun with this portrait. Uh, one of my favorite portraits, just because it's Snoop, man. Uh, he's he's fun. Everything about him, uh, his music, his dreads, his everything. He's just cool. So here I'm working his nose. Mm -hmm doing uh, squidding for his eyebrows. I just kind of fill everything in before I put either fish roe or daikon radish. Just working in the, the dark areas and filling it in so I have a good map of where to put the row. I'm doing his lips. I also use uh, tuna for those and I'm using squid ink to do the line work. You know, I always use the my, I call them the big three, three sauces, you know, squid ink, eel sauce, ube sauce. I'm using taco, which is octopus for his eyeballs. And I just kind of squeeze them in. Of course, uh, Snoop's kind of got the smaller eyes, you know, <laughs> a, little, a little squinty. I wonder why, but uh, yeah. So I'm gonna try to get that right. That kind of relaxed look. His pupils are, are top. It's, it's hard to do the squid ink on the, on the octopus because it's a certain texture to it. It's a little rough. It's not as smooth as it looks. So it takes a little bit of uh, patience to do the pupil because I, I don't want to make it too big or too small. Now I'm using eel sauce, which is pretty much the main sauce I use in this portrait. It's just adds the right complexion with the tuna. Here I'm doing it around his eye and around his lines, just so they're not too dark. I'm blending around his cheeks, just kind of working it in, trying to bring Snoop to life here. As soon as I, you know, uh, color in the eye, it just kind of pops it, you know. Right now it still looks, there we go, there it is. <laughs> kind of brought him, brought him to life there. Uh, this portrait was so much fun. Here it is, the taco leg. Uh, I had to use taco leg for his braids. I couldn't wait. Um, I just thought it would be so neat. I just cut off the whole leg and just, just kind of twirled it up. Because taco legs are generally uh, curled up into the octopus. When they, when they get boiled, they curl up. So... I had to kind of relax it a little bit and spread it out. Put some squid ink on them to darken them. The suction cups are cool with the squid ink because you still see a little bit of the white in there. I'm using black tobacco for his facial hair and this stuff is cool. Uh, I think this is the first time I used this and it just worked really well. It's messy though, <laughs> it gets everywhere. Stuck in your teeth for days. 
been working his hair. It came out well. I mean, I, I really had a lot of fun doing the tobiko and the, the octopus. The ingredients of this were, was, were really great. I'm using daikon radish for his shirt. Pretty simple. You know, it's just the color of it's right. And it's, you know, you just got to be careful not to smudge it. And here we go. I, I had to do it. I had, I, I had to. <laughs> so there's the eel blunt. Works out well. You know, it's brown. I kind of scraped it on the end to make it look like it's got a big ash hanging off of it. Like I said, this is the real California roll. I used mango nori for his gold chain. Just kind of uh, twisted it a little bit, trying to make it look like a chain. Um, it's almost, mango nori is like a fruit roll up. Almost, it kind of tastes like the texture of a fruit roll up. Used daikon radish for his earrings. Uh, sushi rice grain for the, the little reflection, his eyeball. Uh, I just put it in there for a photorealistic look, you know, like that glare from a camera, a little twinkle in his eye. But I, it, it's tough to get him completely centered, I'm always moving them around. So I'm freshening them up here, doing some last minute detail work before I add the, the white fish complexions here, uh, reflections. So I put a little bit on his nose to give it just that, that skin look, which is pretty cool. Here I put a little on his lip, the bottom lip here, on his top of his eye, on his eyebrow. Here we're working his nose. Yeah, it, it's like I said, this portrait was a blast. Here he is, the OG California roll, Snoop Dogg, my man. Yes. If you like this video, you'd be doing me a big favor if you'd smash that subscribe button and lighting up that notification bell so you don't miss a beat. Thanks again. Maki Master, out.